Live Storm Tracker Doppler Radar, sponsored by Homeland Bank. And now, Storm Tracker Doppler Weather with meteorologist Trey Tonneson. Thin line of convection slowly working eastward this morning, providing light to moderate showers for areas in southern Arkansas and north central Louisiana. Light and moderate the story across the region as well. And if you see the notice, if you see if you notice the um, nice and linear pattern of these particular storms, the reason for these is a cold front is pushing these out to the east, which we'll see in just a moment. But as we add in your satellite and radar imagery, see on a wider scale these moving out to the east but not only are they moving east we have quite a bit of cloud cover built up and over the area which is once again hard to see on this product once it's slow or actually stopped in its motion and is stable that's because it actually blends in with the back of this particular product gray colors kind of blend together there but I promise cloud cover is here you can see it across your Glenwood Regional Medical Center Stewart Family Hospital tower cam this morning gray is the story sky wise but by the afternoon hours we'll do a complete 180 and switch into blue sky territory thank goodness temperatures right now above 70 degrees in Monroe West Monroe and as you make your way over towards the eastern side of the state it'll be a little bit warmer on the eastern direction but back towards the west actually a little bit cooler following the passage of the cold front this is a relatively weak system and won't do much to our atmosphere and our general pattern over the next few days but you'll see ahead of that front winds coming pretty quickly out of the south southwest areas like Greenville seeing 22 miles per hour from the south and southwest Monroe at about 15, but this front, you tell right where it's about to pass, this front's moving off to the east and behind it, clear and calm conditions, rusting at about zero, so pretty much calm. Here's the general setup today, seeing that those winds you just saw coming up from the south southwest, pushing that warm, moist air up ahead of the front, and as it does so, provokes those shower chances just a little bit, but thankfully up farther to our north and east, actually on this particular product, this is showing the low as it moves off just to our north. That low is way too far north to see quite a bit of severe weather here, but areas to our north and northeast will eventually see severe weather potential today. This area in yellow is the area I believe will see the biggest chance for severe weather through the afternoon <coughs> and evening hours in areas like Fort Wayne, Columbus, Cincinnati, Indianapolis, all big population centers in that particular risk just happen to be in the warm sector as that warm front moves off ahead of the system here. It's just the way it works out being in that warm sector. They're going to be in the biggest risk for severe weather, but our biggest risk for severe weather won't come until later this week. And it'll come courtesy of this particular atmospheric trend on the west coast. We're seeing a trough deepen and as that trough deepens, it will eventually begin moving out to the east or propagating as we like to say in the meteorological community. As it does so, it'll eventually start the trend of working this particular moisture towards our area. The upper level low, you can really see it circulating here, actually move out to the east, and as it does so, provides a lot of rain and snow to an area of the west coast, which has already seen quite a bit of rain and snow over the, over the last few days. But our general pattern, the front's going to move right on out of here today, leaving us clear on into today. We'll see mostly sunny to clear skies, temperatures into the upper 70s, low 80s. Tonight, clouds, not very much of them. Actually allow us to drop temperature wise overnight it's that daytime heating escapes a little rainy towards the mid portion of the week but by the end of the week we actually end things how we started it crisp clear and calm